Hi, this is Dan Simpson, and I'm holding up the latest uh, edition of Nine Mile. This is the one for spring 2018, and um, I am thrilled to be part of it, and I thought I'd just read a couple, three poems, actually, that um, I am lucky to have in this uh, magazine. The first one is called What the Mice Taught Me. I liked it best when they died in the have of heart traps. None of the futility and sham of releasing them outside with the certainty they'd come back in. But no outright killing either. An unfortunate oversight, I told myself, having forgotten to check the traps for days. Though I never truly forgot them, I just didn't make a habit of putting them on my to-do list. One day I'd had enough. Their shit on my food, their urine, I bought the expensive model with a patented backbreaker. For a while, I had to use earplugs. Now the snap is one more house noise, like the dryer buzzing, that kick from the pipes when the toilet stops. I can't imagine killing a man. I can't even imagine hurting a dog or a cat. Yet. When an old love called me long distance from her lonely life in Albany. I can't quite say that the lying was easy at first. It was easier than I would have thought it should have been. I listened, rapt to her sad story, adding a few random resentments of my own. And even though I didn't know her husband, I figured that he probably had it coming. This next poem is A Friend's Sudden Death. We were sitting in the kitchen when my brother delivered the news. His cat went on cleaning herself. Through a thin wall, his neighbors laughed. I remember how deliberately he poured the tea and paused to inhale its jasmine steam. The way he ran his finger around the rim of his cup. And I'll conclude with a poem called Why We Need New Year's Day and the Passage of Seasons. I wrote this when I had the privilege and pleasure of of being named uh, Lansdowne, Pennsylvania's Poet Laureate. This is a, a borough, actually a very small town. And um, as happens with uh, Poets Laureate, I was asked to write occasional an occasional verse for the changing of the guard at the city borough, or the borough council, excuse me. Um, so uh, when I was asked to, the mayor said, well, maybe could you write something about the uh, why we need New Year's or the passage of seasons? <laughs> I thought, oh, God, this is, oh, this is the kind of pitfall that Poets Laureate just fall deeply into. But, um, well, here, here's what we got. Why we need New Year's Day and the passage of seasons. Because we are iron in a smithy world, which heats and hammers us beyond self-recognition, leaving us slow to learn renewal, too grumpy or fogged most mornings to notice that our hearts still surge blood to every point along the body's map, and that our minds are still what computers emulate. After all, even monks with no other life cannot harness themselves to awareness every second. And yet, a garbage collector I know carries his life like a diamond, and an exhausted mother, immersed in four child babble all day, hitches her mind to a book each night, if only for five minutes, before she careens into sleep. Praise, then, to the policeman who paints portraits, and to the bank teller who keeps a journal. Praise to the thwarted shop steward 
who keeps his standing appointment to play catch with his child. Praise to the heartbroken social worker who subscribes to the symphony. Praise to the math teacher who photographs birds, and to the roofer who, hoping for hope, believes that next year his team will do better. Praise the toddler and the hospice dweller as they stumble in new passages. Praise all who breathe. Praise all who once breathed and now nourish the ground. Praise all whose stories have already been written and all those who still have at least one more chance. Seventy times seven, says Jesus, are the chances we each should have. Let the fireman remember his own life as he chops with the axe. Let neither the minister neglect his wife, nor the doctor her husband. Let none of us simply swallow our lives whole. But if the minister, the doctor, and we should fail, let us have new years and fresh seasons. Let us have 70 times 7 chances.